you tell me guys you got nothing better to do than sit around and watch YouTube videos all day. But hey, me and Mo here at Drawn to Engage, we appreciate the views. Here today on the tabletop here, we got the Maxpedition Mini Vehicle Bag and Digital Camo. On the outside here, we got the Spider Co. Center Fonte knife. It's rather nice, nice utility knife. Comes in handy, sharp. For a light, I carry the Stream Light. It's got three patterns, bright, strobe, and light. The back side here, we got the Multi-Tool Leatherman Juice S2. In the orange variety, of course. Now this comes in pretty handy. It's got all sorts of stuff on here for you. You got the pliers, scissors, uh, Allen, Phillips. Right here we got some paracord just in case, some, some cording. All right, let's uh, jump right in and see what we got going on in here. All right, first we have a map. Yes, nobody wants to hear their old lady yelling at them. Three o'clock in the morning that we're lost. It's not fun. Next, we got our stalker gloves. Protect your hands. And we got some heating pads for your hands and feet. Come in handy for the wife and the children. Here we got a little bit of first aid. I also carry a pen, these are triangular bandages, so you can also use these as a, a tourniquet if need be, which I strongly suggest people uh, try to educate themselves a little bit on first aid so they can help people when needed or themselves. Alright, we got some medical scissors for cutting clothes off people, legally. We got a fire starter here, nice uh, sparks. Catch my bench on fire here. Here we got a little bit of dryer lint for uh, helping starting a fire, a little fire tender. It's really easy, just get it out of your dryer, throw it in a Ziploc bag, and there you go. And the easier way of starting a fire, matches. These are wind and waterproof. Last but not least, we have the whistle, which I strongly suggest people, if you're gonna have a a vehicle bag, you need to have some type of signaling device. Now this one has a built-in compass, a thermometer, and a built-in magnifying glass. So if you're trying to read the small little roads on the map, you're able to. Now this is an ongoing project here, obviously, so we appreciate your input. If you have any uh, suggestions, let us know, comment, and make sure if you like our channel, go ahead and subscribe. Thanks, guys.